When I left Novell, I started a little company. We, we um, Ray Nordiff funded, he put two and a half million bucks into this little company on a handshake. Literally, we had no agreement with him. Other, He said, Newman, I trust you. I'll give you two and a half million dollars. Come over here. Let's start this business away you go. And we started this little third party testing company. Ray put in two and a half million bucks and he was on our board and he was the toughest old bird. When you get that guy's money, when you take somebody's money, prepare for pain. So I'm telling you, you are going to be in the pain cave for a while uh, until you return that money with some interest, uh, some increase, which we'll talk about in a second. But we, we built a plan around this business and we went off and executed on it. It was really going great and then we had this downturn. First year, we were just cranking along, we started hiring people and then our business just died. And I went to Ray and I said, Ray, what do we do? And he goes, well, how are you gonna make payroll next week? And he says, and I'm thinking he's gonna, Uncle Ray's gonna throw some more money in the company, forget it. He saw this great opportunity to teach me something. He goes, well, how are you gonna make payroll? I go, I don't know. He goes, well, do you got some money? I go, yeah. Well, why don't you give the company a loan? Am I going, I'm not loaning this company money. There's a bunch of idiots running it. Me. Uh, but he said, you know what? You need to get some skin in the game. He says, I got money in. Why don't you put some money in? I'm like going, well, that's kind of risky. He says, well, you told me that this was a great business. I'm like going, yeah, I guess I did. <laughs> so I ponied up about 60 grand to cover the payroll. I said, well, will you pay me some interest if I put the money in? He goes, sure, we'll pay you interest on the money. How much do you want? I said, 10%. I thought I'm really gouging this old guy. He goes, okay, I'll take your money. But the most important, he says, I really like it when you have skin in the game, Newman. I go, I don't know if I really like it, but I'm willing to go along here. And uh, boy, some things changed and turned and it just took off after that. I got my money back. Ooh, my wife would have killed me if I lost that money. But uh, anyway, uh, I learned something about business. It's important that you get people to have skin in the game. Whether it's um, time, effort, they take a lower salary, whatever it is, you have them put some skin in the game because then they're aligned with what you're aligned with. You give them equity, you give them to put skin in the game and away the business goes. And then you just do whatever it takes to get the business done. But you never do anything dishonest, guys. One thing that I'll tell you, I'll guarantee you, if you do something dishonest in a business, you, think, you may think that it's under the covers and nobody will ever see it, it'll come out someday. And you may even go to jail. Don't do that. It's not worth any upside risk that there is. Always be honest in your dealings. In fact, you're not gonna be able to hold a temple recommend if you don't. So make sure that you're honest with, with people.